Right, here we have a fine example of a quality British piano. This is a Brinsmead and it's been completely reconditioned recently. And when I say completely reconditioned, I mean completely reconditioned. I shall show you inside. The case has been repolished. The key covers have been recovered. Now, we can see here the full iron frame. And you can see there's new tuning pins and the string, the copper windings on the bass strings are pretty shiny, as are the treble strings, which are all lovely and shiny. So it has been restrung. It has new hammer heads fitted. It's had new tapes, new little butt leathers. The keys have all been out. The key tops have been re replaced in a grain celluloid. And it's all been put back together and it's been done very professionally by a company called Ladbrook's Pianos. Um, I don't know when, it might have been 10 years ago, maybe a little more, but it certainly hasn't been used much since all this work was done. Now, it's a thousand pounds to restring a piano, and the case is another three or four hundred, depending, the action's all got to be rebuilt, new hammers, it's, it's had hundreds, if not 2,000 pounds spent on it, this piano. I'll show you the action working. So we have the damper pedal there, lifting off. We have the soft pedal. All working. Lovely tone. So there we have it. A very nice, clean piano. Brinsmead dates to the 30s. It might be early 40s. Made by a quality firm that really knew what they were the, what they were doing. And it's all been done. It won't need anything doing other than tuning and regulation for 50 years. Okay, so I'll put it back together and give you a little tune on it. That's the four. Notice the backs of the piano's all been blacked and a really good professional job. Okay, the handsome piano. It was never fitted with candlesticks. There's no holes where the sconces were fitted. So it dates it to post-1928. And you can see there the little sticker by Ladbrook, Ladbrook's Pianos Limited, Birmingham, with the people that reconditioned it. music desk.